I will show you how to make a copy of this Leonardo da Vinci's drawing on a gridded up piece of paper. I started by drawing some lines with pencil very lightly across the paper matching the guide points at the edges. When I started the drawing I realised that a lot of Leonardo da Vinci's marks that he used were going in a certain direction and I'm right-handed and when I tried to copy these marks I discovered it was quite awkward and then I realised it was because he was left-handed and this is easier to make marks with your left hand going in this direction. So I've decided to reverse the drawing and mirror image it so that it's easier for me so I can make another drawing that I can copy because I'm right-handed. So I've mirror imaged the drawing and I'm now going to start again for a right-handed person. So the first thing I'm going to do is join up the guidelines that I've made on the side of the paper with my HB pencil. Lightly, I'm going to lightly draw a grid. I'd like to make the drawing the same size, similar size, actually the squares are slightly bigger to the original. If you want to make a different size to your original drawing then you'll have to change the size of the square either bigger or smaller depending on what size you want your final drawing to be. Now I can look at my grid and I can see that if I start here it's number four on line one. So I'm going to start by drawing this line which connects with this part of the paper here roughly down there and then there's a sort of triangular shape in the corner Don't worry if you don't get it quite right, you can always rub it out and start again. Right, now I've got the rough guidelines, I now need to rub out some of the grid lines before I can develop the shading.
so I can start now I'm going to start drawing in the details and add the shading because I've reversed the image because I'm right-handed all my marks are naturally going this way which is the mirror image of Leonardo's drawing so I'm usually going to start around the eye and I'm going to put in these hatching lines building it up slowly with pencil going for the contrasting areas but I'm not going to build it up I'm not going to press heavily to begin with 